in front of a huge crowd and millions watching across the Islamic world. The supreme leader of Iran, just a couple of days after that country had rained missile hell on Israel, addressed not only Israel but the world, calling upon Muslims everywhere to unite. The Khamenei said that Israel would be demolished. He also, holding a sniper rifle in this address, issued a warning. He said that Israel's response might come, but that doesn't mean that Iran is done yet. Take a look. The Supreme Leader of Iran, Ayatollah Ali Khamenei, made a rare public appearance in Tehran on Friday. Khamenei led the Friday prayers at the Imam Khomeini Musalla to commemorate the death of Hezbollah chief Syed Hassan Nasrallah. The last time he led Friday prayers was five years ago to commemorate the death of Qasim Soleimani, commander of Iran Revolutionary Guard Corps. The streets of Tehran were flooded by lakhs of people. Every road, every corner of the mosque was plastered with posters of the Hezbollah chief and Hamas leader Ismail Haniye. The Iranian supreme leader got visibly emotional as he hailed Nasrallah as a martyr. We are all in a state of pain and mourning the martyrdom of our dear Sayyid. This is a big loss. However, our mourning does not mean losing hope. Khamenei also recalled Tuesday's missile strikes on Israel, referring to Iran's attack as least punishment. The move taken by our armed forces was the least punishment for the occupying Zionist regime in the face of the crimes, the unbelievable crimes committed by that regime, uh, the bloodthirsty regime. With a sniper rifle next to him in a symbolic show of strength, he also justified the October 7 Hamas attack on Israel. And our acts of flood operation that October last year uh, was carried out, that was a correct move, logical move, based on international law, and Palestinians had the right to do so. In his address that lasted over an hour, Khamenei also issued a direct warning to Israel. Any nation has the right to defend its soil, its houses, its country, its interests. They have the right to defend that in the face of aggressors. We neither hesitate, we will not give up, and, but we will not rush at the same time. Khamenei's address was broken by chants of death to Israel and America and cries in support of Hezbollah and Hamas. The enemy of the Islamic Republic of Iran and the enemy of the Iranian nation is the enemy of the Palestinian nation. The enemy is the same. Uh, the order is issued from one place. And that order is issued from the same place to attack Islamic nations and Islamic countries. The Supreme Leader of Iran has made his and Iran's intent clear that this war is far from over. Bureau Report, India Today.